Hello guys, welcome back to Bitshara Tips. In this video, we'll be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 13.5.1 on your iPhone. As we know that we all use iPhone, right? But some of you guys usually always used to look for some video on jailbreak iOS 13.5.1. So here we are. Before that, let me make sure that this method works on iPhone models from iPhone 6s to iPhone 10. Also, you need to have a USB drive. 2 GB is enough, I guess. So let's get started. First, you need to go to the website I have given in the description. From here, download the ISO file according to what your system width is. For example, it depends. Most probably, it will be 32 or 64. Also, download the Rufus from here. Let's wait till both the files get completely downloaded. Once after download, open the Rufus and connect your USB. Now select your USB drive and select the downloaded ISO file. Now click on start. Click yes and ok when it is prompted. Once it is done, shut down your system. Once it is completely turned off, now power on your system and press F12 right after to get into boot menu. Select graphics safe and proceed. Now wait for a few seconds to get it completely loaded fully. It will take few seconds, maybe a couple of times, but even though you have to wait. Now type anon and press enter. After that, enter the password which is void linux and press enter. After that, type sudo checkray and press enter. Once downloaded something like this, connect your iPhone and wait it for to recognize your iPhone. Make sure you remove passcode in order to avoid the error. After that, navigate it to start and enter. Now proceed with next. Once your iPhone gets into recovery mode, select start and follow the instructions. As you can see, my device entered in DFU mode very successfully. Your phone will be jailbreaking right after this. 
Let's wait and see. As you can see, my F1 is rebooting. Once the phone reboot, open Checkray and install Cydia right from there. So here is the Cydia. So that's all. Also note this that the tethered jailbreak, which means what we have done so far is a tethered jailbreak. So if your phone turns off, you need to jailbreak again. So guys, this is all about how to jailbreak your device. So even there are few kind of instructions which also already mentioned above that you have to make sure or else the MTA process will be completely having errors. So one thing which I mentioned, I would like to make you notice that remove the passcode, right? So that it will not be having any kind of errors. So that's all about when it comes to how to jailbreak your iPhone. I use 13.5.1. If you felt like this video is helpful, do let us know in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for the notification. This is Shahin signing off from Gitcher. See you soon. Peace out.